So Lorenzo, we are on a roll at the moment. Yes, we are. We're putting up videos for joke, man. Yeah. And we're back with another video today. We're doing something not special, but it is special it for the is. kids. You're excited. Tiara's yeah. excited. Marcelo's excited. We did do this last year in the summer. Yes, we but did. But we're actually going to watch it in Birmingham. So it's going to be we a are. little bit different. So we're actually going to Monster Jam. Everyone's literally ready. We're about to go. And yeah, we're going to see what Monster Jam in Birmingham is like. Yeah. Now, I'm switching things up, Lorenzo. Usually, yeah, I take this big FX3 with me. Yes. I'm not doing that no more. Are you, it's are you game gonna, over. Are you gonna Gone. I'm bringing a GoPro out. Oh, okay. I think recently I've been using this camera in the videos, yeah? Yeah. And it's not looked too bad. Ain't that sinners? So I bought it at Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Did, yeah. So, yeah, I'm bringing out this camera. I'm leaving the effort free yeah. home for the first time. And I'm going to continue the rest of the vlog. And I mean, all the vlog. <laughs> With this GoPro, okay, we're gonna see how it's gonna look. All right. If you don't like the video quality here, guys, let me know in the comment section below. Tell me, do you know what? No, go back to the FX3. I don't like. I don't think they care. I think they do care. Don't I, you think I, so? I think they still, I think they just care as well. Well, audio is gonna be king on this camera here. True. Audio is half decent on this. Yeah. You slightly washed. Yeah. However, better autofocus straight away. Yeah. That does have good autofocus. Yeah. But you gotta keep changing settings and stuff. Do you know what I mean? So. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see what this day brings with the gold, bro. Okay. One last clip on this camera before we go. <laughs> see how I go? We got a gold, man. Too much Fortnite. Look at this Fortnite on the go. We got Fortnite here, Fortnite there, Fortnite everywhere. That's right. And Tamara's so not feeling 100% wild today, are you? You still don't feel well? What's the matter? My head hurts. You got a headache? A nose ache? No way. What? Hey, it's not hey, people. She was bomb. She literally vomited about what seven times yesterday. Yeah, Do you know what I mean? Something you ate. It was more than seven times. How many times was it again? Don't listen. Don't brag. Do you know what I mean? You can't stunt on me because you vomited loads of times. That's crazy. You are you feel feeling well enough to go? You feeling well enough to go to Montejan? Okay, that's the main thing. How about you, Mrs. Afro? Yeah. You ready to go? Yeah. It's gonna be super loud though, isn't it? It's gonna be extremely loud because oh, don't oh, forget, my the last time we went. Badly right now. Ears are hurting. What's that ear problem, man? The last time we went yeah. was at West Ham's training yes. football ground. Yes. What's it called again? London Stadium. London Stadium. Yeah. And it obviously it was outside. Yeah. This time it's inside. So, it's so it will be very loud. If I was you. Last time it Apple, was loud, didn't it? It was dumb loud. Bring yeah. your Apple headphones. You remember that guy that was in a Spider-Man car and it literally went so high in the sky like that. And he came down like that. Yeah, I remember. That See how excited this kid is. I love yeah, it. it. I do sick. like it though, Buck. I do like it. All these people playing, but still, it doesn't make you any better to play me. So oh, you can I'm beat me. So, I'm so good. Yeah, you have decent. Do you know what it is though? You and FIFA. What? Are you in the middle of a game? Yeah. Play, 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 play. It's fine. Yeah. When you play people, yeah, yeah. you don't know how to like what's the like, Build up the play. Oh no, definitely now, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Like I you play like I don't know, you play like it's a game of that. Nah, 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 nah. I know I know what to do. Yeah. yeah. Nil nil. Okay then. Just started. Just started. Yeah. Oh, it's ultimate team, was that? Yeah. Okay. Is that you? Yeah. Okay, he's one on one. One v one with the keeper. He shoots. Mello scores. Decent. Yeah, That's what we're saying. Yeah. I reckon I beat him, are you? You reckon you beat him? Yeah. I gave you a tough game the other day. You give me a tough game, yeah? Yeah. However, I was Chelsea. You beat me 2 1. Yeah, I'm still, games. and I still beat you in games. I bad you. You were who? Who are you? Barcelona. Barcelona, and I was Chelsea. A week in Chelsea. Do you know what I'm trying to say? You still have, what, four stars? Listen, five stars. Every, for every 100 games that we play on FIFA, yeah. You win about two of them, one of them. That's a lie. That's a swear that down. A lie. That is the truth. That's a lie. You do not beat me on FIFA. I said I'll beat you like 20 times. Lies. Oh, it's a penalty. Yes. Okay. Melo's going to go left. Oh, it's a good nice. penalty. Yeah. Someone's been living on the game. No, not bad. No, I haven't. It's just. I'll play it every now and again, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, Melo has got a new bed, which he got for his birthday. A yeah. brand new bed, and the room looks so much better now, doesn't it? It does, yeah. It's the same as Lorenzo's, but there's actually space to move around now. You yeah. walk in, he's got his setup here looking good. Do you know what I'm saying? The wall needs to be sorted out, though. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? But. Oh, this has to be thrown out as well. That is a mess, man. But it looks so much better, man. Yeah, it and it's not boiling hot either. And this is what I mean about using up electricity. This is what I'm talking about. He's got one game on here. And what's this? That's not, that's not, that's not. <laughs> someone, someone's screen sharing. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Anyways, we are gone. Obviously, you're not coming to Monster Jam, are you? No. Love your tracksuit. It looks sick. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Let's see if we can keep it clean. Right, it really is actually time to change to this camera now. I can't believe that. That was effort. Oh, so I had to wait, yeah, while security checked. Because they tried to tell me I couldn't bring up GoPro here. No, they, had, they had no one bring anything like this before, so they had to go and confirm. With I'm a GoPro though. Yeah, I know. If I was to bring the big FX3, then I can you understand. understand it, yeah. But what's the difference between me bringing this and a phone? And a phone? Oh, we're here to promote right? the show. So we're here to promote it. Obviously, this is, we have PR tickets in it. So we're here to bring the family. Anyways, we're here now. Time to enjoy the show. Even with the GoPro, we're having problems, right? That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, we're in Tiago Hall, it's loud! It's loud! So why are it's so loud in here? Look at the whips, look at the cars, man. The cars are moving insane. You ready for this? You ready for the effort? Oh, what? Yeah, 
Michael Boy, o meu urso, o São Puma. E vamos ao Oceano, vamos ver se é o Vamos ficar aqui de mim. Ok, there we are, there we are, there we are. So it's currently half time at the show. What do you think of the show so far? It's good, isn't it? It is good, man, honestly. The man's just going to get some drinks and sort of see them as well. I've got a big baby, so I didn't wear any headphones. See, this is the thing. My ears are actually hurting because it's really loud in here. But I don't want to get like a whimper for earbuds in. Why? There's a man in front of me that's got earbuds, so I've told the vendors to go and buy a few earbuds. It's like really loud, like extremely loud in here. Do you know what I mean? A lot of these people out here have come prepared. Do you know what I'm saying? Don't well, you think it's really, really loud? Isn't it? You enjoying that lovely burger, Maya? Yes, Maya was vomiting yesterday. Today she's eating burgers. Maya! What do you think? Do you know what? It's good, but I feel like it needs to be on the dirt, like the last time. Yeah, the, one at, uh, West the outdoor one, and yeah, they yeah. had the dirt ramp. There was yeah. loads of ramps. This ramps one's just got the one in the middle. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's yeah. still good, it but could you've been to the other one, we know how good it can be. Yeah, Out, yeah outside one's bad. Yeah. But still, but it's, it's, but it's warm in here. Yeah, it's nice, exactly. Yeah, yeah exactly. It's nice so it's like what you watch from there. Uh, but it's good though, I'm really enjoying it. What do you think of the show? It was alright. It was alright, innit? Yeah. What do you think, Big Tiago? Good, man. It was alright, innit? The whole thing was good. Was it? I didn't see it because huh? you, you took me home halfway. Yeah, we left a little bit early because one thing I didn't want to happen was us get caught in the traffic on the way back. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Because you don't care, kid. He doesn't know. He just doesn't know. He's not being. You're getting caught inside the car park. That's what I mean. The car park. Do you know when you get in the car park and it's back and it's backed up and you don't know how long it is to get out? Yeah. I get like a. I don't like it. We always do. Wherever we go, we always leave just a little bit early if we know we're going to get stuck in traffic. It's just a habit. It's always a habit. So, anyways, we're back home. I'm going to continue the vlog tomorrow. Hang on a minute. I thought he was going to change this to the GoPro. I thought we were going to go for the whole vlog. We should have tried it, you know, the whole vlog. We should have gone for the whole vlog. I'm going to start. First thing in the morning with the GoPro instead. Good morning. It's actually kind of early. It's just gone eight o'clock. I say early, early on a Saturday for us when we have nothing going on and everyone's still in bed. And I've been up, I've been awake for about an hour, just lying on my phone, scrolling. Come downstairs, went to make a coffee, and we have no milk. And I haven't booked any shopping to come in today because I went and got shopping the other day. And I'm gonna get shopping to come in on Tuesday because obviously it's bank holiday, Monday, and it's Easter Sunday. So I'm, gonna, <laughs> I'm just basically I'm going to the shop. I just come on to say I'm walking to the shop this morning and. It's something that I don't think I've ever done to go and get milk. Usually we send the kids, but they're all asleep. And I thought, you know what? The sun is shining. I'm dressed. Let's just go. Also, the reason I was up early this morning was because I had the door go. Uh, I bought a parcel, which I am hoping, and it feels like it might be something for the garden, something I buy every single year. Really, I should just take care, better care of the ones that I got. But I'm thinking this one might be a little bit more easy to maintain than the ones I've got previously. I would have brought the dog with me but there's nowhere to tie her up outside the shop. And in all fairness, I actually wouldn't trust her being tied up outside the shop. She'd probably get loose or she's, she's very much a barker. And obviously, because she's a German Shepherd, she's quite intimidating. And I'd hate to feel that other people felt intimidated by her because we hate when we see big dogs off leads when we had the kids. Even though they might be harmless, they might be friendly, it just, they look intimidating. So we would never do that to anybody else. So yeah, it's actually quite nice. I'm in a t-shirt, acting like it's summer. Do I need anything else? Do I need anything else? I don't think so. Got the milk. This is my problem. I can never walk into a shop and get the one thing I need and walk back out. I have to check to make sure I don't need anything else. No. Just the milk. We're all good. Okay, cheers. Cheers. I tell you what, it is a really nice day. It's 
It's not piping hot, it's fresh. But the sun's out, so it makes it really nice. I'm literally almost at the house. I'm thinking I'll get the kids off. I think it's definitely, definitely a walk kind of day. Maybe take them on their bikes or something. Just something fun. Um, they usually get up and go in the garden. But it just feels so nice. I hear the birds chirping. <laughs> I don't know why the street lights are still on. Uh, but yeah, gotta get the kids off. Get out of the house for a little bit. Because me and Nathan are heading off somewhere fun later. And the kids aren't coming. It's adults only. This is what I picked up extra. And there's a certain person in our house who loves these. I'm not going to say it too loud. Just get everyone's away. I'm going to put this with a stash that I've got. So I actually have a nice little collection going. And these are all the large eggs. We have two bags of smaller eggs and also Easter hunt eggs. Um, But you guys, if you know who this will be for, let me know in the comments below who is a Toblerone fan. Now, you'd have to pay really close attention to the Meet the Greens videos to know this. But who do you think out of everybody in the family is obsessed with Toblerone? If you get this right, then 10 points to you because that is a hard one. We have this Kit Kat one. I got it because it looks cool. Um, Who is obsessed with Reese's? This is the easy one. Who's obsessed with Reese's? So go to the comments and tell me who's obsessed with the Toblerone. I want the name. And who's obsessed with Reese's? Make sure you put which egg you're referring the person to as well. Um, And then we've got some caramel. Cadbury's caramel. A big Maltese. There's one down there. I think a Cadbury's orange. The one I just got. This is a caramel -like one. This is not your average chocolate. It's that golden caramel chocolate. I don't know if you guys, I think you kind of hate it or love it. My dad used to love this kind of chocolate and I love this kind of chocolate. And there's another person in the house who really likes this. It's the same person that likes this. So maybe you might guess who it is. And then I got a Terry's chocolate orange one down there and another Toblerone one because the box is cute. Leave me alone. They're currently being covered by my rain jacket. And this is probably the worst room to keep. And we put them in here yesterday because they was in my car. We had to go get Mello's bed from Ikea and there was no space for it. But this is the hottest room in the house. This radiator pumps out heat like it's Sahara Desert. So maybe we need to move them because I know when we're not here this evening, they're going to put the heating on. So I might need to find another place for these. But yeah, Easter is tomorrow. So I ain't got to be like panicking about it. One of the greatest gifts I've had of all time, used every single day, multiple times, is my coffee machine. And I will praise it every single time I have the chance. But yes, I will walk to the shop to get milk to have a coffee from here because this coffee machine is better than Starbucks. I've just started it off, so it always has to push through any water that's in there and then good to make a coffee. So it's what I expected and more. So I've got some little decorations. I know it's tomorrow, but we do a nice dinner and breakfast. So I thought I'd get a few things to make Easter day more exciting. I'm not gonna show the kids in the Tiago's crept in here. So some little bits here, you can see what it is from here. But this, is what I'm talking about. So if you guys are regular viewers here, you will know that from this tree to this tree, I hang a hammock. The old hammock is there on the floor, but I left it outside. I should have took it down when it started to get bad, but the kids used to go on it, so I thought I'd leave it. In all fairness, I think it was like 30 pounds and we had it for the whole of the summer. So I don't think for the price, it's that bad. So that's gonna be chucked away. Uh, I need to move that, that's um, the brush for the Astro. But you can see there and here. And now I have a black one. So I'm hoping this will last better um, for the weather. And then when I do wash it, it will still come up nice. So yeah, let's try and assemble this. So here it is in all its glory. <laughs> It doesn't look like much, it's just literally a hammock hanging from the tree. But when I tell you how comfortable this is when you're sitting in it, and this gets really good sun through this gap here. Might have to cut through, the, through these trees a little bit back, but it gets really nice, really nice sun. Now, no one's used this tree in a while, but it should still hold. Other than to test it out, I'm probably the best person because if it can hold me, it can hold everybody else in the house. So I'm in, but, it's really low. So I need to figure out what I can do to make it tighter. So I think, I don't know what, I don't know if this one is, is, is longer than the other one we had before, but for some reason I'm sitting really, really low. Uh, I think anyone who gets in it will sit really low. I'm actually like more or less touching the floor. So I need to tweak it a bit. Okay, now that's perfect height. I've just had to double it around the tree. I maybe should have done that tree because it's bigger. But because the rope I don't think will go around and have enough slack, I've done the thinner one. But this should hold. This tree is quite strong. And I did test it, guys. I did test it. And it does work. And we are quite half the floor. So, job done. So, we're in the car and on the road yet again. But it's quite quiet other than the radio. Because it's just me and Nathan. 
we are heading to uh, Manchester we're actually going on a couple's even out to Manchester and we're going to somewhere we've never been before yeah. should we say now or should we wait till we get there um I'm gonna say now you can say now I've never been before it's the cube it's yeah. in that is it Arndale? Yes, yeah, so, yes, yeah, so we're going to Manchester to um Arndale shopping centre. Yes. I think it's there anyway. Yes it is. I'm pretty sure it is. It's like there's like they've got like an under is it underground? I don't know. Oh, I don't they've know. got some sort I of like idea. area where oh, you can do golf. Yeah, golf, mini golf and all that. There's a mini golf, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's like a bar and then there's a cube experience. So it should be fun. You do it in pair you do it in um two groups of two so obviously there's four of us going so we'll be in against each other i think we'll be couples against couples yeah. so nathan's super competitive i'm competitive he's way more competitive than me and uh, marcus and ashley are competitive as well so it should be fun but yes we've literally just left the house saying we're going to take take two hours to get there um because it's like really into manchester yeah yeah, yeah it's not like, like some parts of manchester are super close to us yes like trapper center ain't that far yeah from us really like we can get to the outskirts of manchester in just over an hour yeah you can actually like, yeah. an, like an hour yeah <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, so this is saying two hours, so it's, I think it's in, and but I think it's like more. You have to go into Manchester, so obviously you well, can't. It's the drive. same place we went to the other day when Lorenzo went. Uh, oh, that. the Sports Direct. Yeah, the Harland thing. Ah, okay. Was on the stage and that. Yes, yeah, it did take a while to get there. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, we're in it for the long haul. Nathan's gonna listen to some football. I've got my phone and my headphones. I'm probably gonna stop and get a coffee on the way. Like probably like halfway, so we can it switch seems over. Seems funny how we're in gym calls though, isn't it? Because we're in gym clothes, because you have to be limber, you have to be, you have yeah, to move. Like, and... I want to go and get something to eat later, innit? Listen, my gym clothes can be versatile. No, I mean, all I black. Can't. No way. I've got this Nike gym you got top. You've got Michelin stuff? No, no, I'm just saying, in the back, I ain't even got like a, a coat to match it. I've got a, like a uh, no face bomber jacket. You've got have a Nike like, hoodie there in the back yeah, of the car. No, no, but I didn't want to wear that. It's just know. acting. Listen, in any case, you could buy something at a shopping centre. No, 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 no. That's we not could not buy a new outfit. Happening. Maybe we could buy each other's outfits. No. <laughs> it's, it's not happening, no. <gasps> Good idea, though, isn't it? A quick pit stop. And the thing is, you know what, yeah? We never, ever, ever stop at Moto. We never really stop at Moto because Moto has pasta and we don't really do pasta but sometimes they have Perret. where is he we never really stop at moto do we never always stop at starbucks only the one that has Perret yes. every now and again yes but this one i'm not too sure if it has a Perret. i know yeah but we're gonna get something to eat because this is the last service station before we get off the yeah, motorway yeah, and we need petrol let's get something small yeah prove me wrong they have a Perret, but it's on the other side of what we're doing can you see Perrette's on the other side and Marx's princess and greg's um i'm gonna get something from Perrette. Yeah. i'll get Perrette as well yeah. I hate walking over these bridges though. They always look so dodgy. I know. <laughs> Actually, it's not. Oh, it's there. It's just there. Good enough to walk over. Perfect. <laughs> We're going to have to remember this service station for next time. Because they've got Perret. Yeah, but and they've they don't got, have any yeah, And they've got uh, KFC. And they've got Greg's. And they've got uh, Burger King as well. So they've got. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Perfect, our favourite, and they stopped for the Living Town. I think they yeah. brought them back though. Six pounds sixty-five. Jesus, what a place! Is that the? That is the spinach, the spinach one. Spinach, yeah. Doesn't it have the cauliflower in that one, does it? Or does it? Oh no, I don't want pasta. No, 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 no it does have cauliflower in it. Does it? Yeah, it does. I don't want pasta though. You don't want pasta. What else? What's that? Hummus. Oh, Get some eggs on Marks and Spencer's? Yeah, I have to do that. Oh no, I don't need to. Um, yeah. Might be cheaper in Marks and Spencer's. I can't bother to go to Marks and Spencer's. <laughs> this is my this I used to get this all the time, every time. So good. Mmm, that looks nice as well. 95p cheaper, he should have waited. But if they have thingy here, I was gonna get it actually. I need to get some uh, veg for tomorrow <laughs> for Easter dinner. No. <laughs> if I've got it, I might as well get it, but I don't think they have. Uh, you're getting a big water. No, I've got one in the car. I've okay. got a big water in the car. What? How big is it? Uh, it's a big, big one. Oh, I thought it's by this one. Yeah, it's by that. I thought you were going to get like a normal drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, like a I'm Pepsi stopped. or. They haven't got any uh, Rabina Zero. Oh. Sugar free, should I say, not Zero. Let's get Pepsi Max. Pepsi Max will do. That'll do. You don't understand how long that just took us to park. That's a joke. We was actually here 50 minutes ago outside the no, shopping centre. I got we, was, we got here just on four. <laughs> it feels like 50 minutes. <laughs> it took us out of Manchester back in. The car, the car you didn't fit in the car park. So what you do? You have to try and find an outside for parking. But what happens when everything's one way? Literally, I had to just straight up reverse in the middle of the road a minute ago. Oh, yeah. Honest to God. I'm dying for toilet as well. He so needs toilet. We're late. It's mad stress. But we're here, we're out the car, and it's saying it's gonna take us four minutes to get there, so that isn't too bad. Go on, Nate.
you do it? What you do it? Oh, oh my god! Careful, watch your back leg. Tara! Oh, you're not out. Can you balance? Jesus! <laughs> Oh no! Oh, Two thousand points on my head, Yes! Come on! Yes! <laughs> First time! Two thousand points! Yes! <laughs> well done. That was good, man. Well done. <laughs> we are back from the queue, but it's actually the next day. And as you can see, it's Easter. All the kids are excited. Now, we haven't gone crazy. Well, Tara hasn't gone crazy because she's the person that's got all these Easter eggs. Um, usually, well, I want to say usually, probably about probably about five years ago, we used to go crazy with eggs. Get everybody like five, ten eggs each, which is stupid. It literally, should last them for a whole year. So yeah, we've got a few eggs on the table. I'm about to call the kids in. Happy Easter, you love! Yay! 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 Chocolo! Chocolo! Yay! Happy Easter! What's Mello? Mello! As per usual, Mello is in his dungeon. And he haven't, he hasn't, no one's in his room yet. What? He hasn't finished in the makeup, has he? No, I've showed us a little bit of his room. Oh, yeah. Copy yes. and paste of my room. He looks very much like your yeah. room. But it makes sense, though, doesn't it? Yeah. It really does. Excuse me. <laughs> Straight away. Right. What egg would you pick as your favourite egg? Go and have a look all the way up and down the table. All the way. Walk all the way up and down. Have a look. Yeah, all the which, which, which of the big eggs do you like the look of? Which egg do you like? Mm, that one. That egg. You're picking that egg out of all the eggs out of there. So it's got a monkey in there. That's crazy. A That's crazy. Right. That's I love it. <laughs> it's so cute. That one. These ones. That's a chocolate. It's not even an egg. I like chocolate. I know you like small <laughs> chocolate. <laughs> right, Tiago, which egg would you like? Which egg do you think is nice? What? Are you like crazy or something? Right, let's go to the real people. Honestly. So right, pick your egg. The real people. Oh, you know what she's going to pick. Yeah. Maya, with a Toblerone. Oh, yeah. Shella doesn't, Shella like, doesn't chocolate. like chocolate, so she's gonna go for oh, the smallest Oh yeah, she doesn't like chocolate. I'm gonna get a bag of sweets somewhere. Go on, Mug. I'm gonna pick. Gonna oh my. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that fell asleep. Alright, Reese's on the menu. I'll do crunchy one. Crunchy. 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 Yep. Pick a mid-sized egg, not a big egg. I feel like, you know what? I hope I can let me see. I'm not gonna take all these eggs back. Hey, and, uh, and listen, and on, and it's all about the cabinet's eggs, man. I'll take a mini egg as well. Aye, aye, don't, aye, calm got down, a, kid. Everyone's got a small yeah. one of these okay. from Nanny. Even me and you, Nanny, we've got one of these. Oh, yeah. Actually, eight of these for everyone to have one. I did get the big Kit Kat one. I thought that looked nice. I hadn't seen it before. It's like different. I think it's got bits in it, and then the egg has got bits in it as well. And there's also a caramel -like egg there as well. And a more piece like egg. Oh. No, I swear I you have an egg. Caramel like egg. That's I swear you like that. Egg. No. You do like I like caramel like, but I don't know if I want it in an egg though. No, it's nice. I mean, it's too, too okay. much chocolate, man. Mom, does yeah. dad have an open, unopened egg? I have an unopened like egg from about four, four or five years ago. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. There's one on top of the cabinet. Oh, the one that I got, yeah. From Fortin's. Yeah. The Fortin's egg. Oh what if it's any good? Yeah, open it yet. No, don't do it. Yeah, what if it's any no, good? No, it hasn't opened. It's delicious. Oh, oh what's that? My oh my god, you missed that whole thing, man. Yeah, another go, put it here. Another go? Yeah. It's me. Oh, oh my god. Oh, yeah. That is terrible. Right. Go on. So far, oh, wait. Marcel's in the lead. Marcel's in the lead. Oh! oh! Yeah. Is that enough? Yeah, hey, it was, was mouth, oh, Actually, I don't know. I think it was hand. No, that was no, mouth. Was it? That was mouth. <laughs> that was mouth, is it? Why have you got a... Oh, why have you got a dick? So that's two. We've just got two shots. Have you got a dick? Oh, so Lord. That's so bad, crazy, man. That is so bad. Right, your turn. Oh, you know what? I'm taking that mouth. I'm winning 200 points. <laughs> I take it back. Come on, let's see if you can oh, do it better. Oh, do you want nervous, sir? <laughs> so, is it an underarm? No. Or is it an overarm? Oh, do you want a man? I just don't know what to do, though. Just get it! Belly, belly, body. So, body, what's body? Is it 20 points? Body is 20 points. 20 points. Oh, 20 One more shot. One more shot. You're the same as Lorenzo. No. Oh, no. What was that? Basket. 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 30 points. 50 points. 50 points. I beat you. I got 70. Damn. You can't get points. 
He got a hit of uh, his mouth for 200, his head for 60, ears for 50, arms and so on and so on. And we've got two shots and they had three shots so far. So Muscle's in the lead. Go on, I'll take that as head because that's 60 points. And that means the winner which wins the trophy goes to the one and only Marcel! Yeah!